Hi hey guys, just a quick update. As you can see, daylight holes are done and there's a coat of primer on there and I've got that roof vent kind of put in there. It's raining out here and I've got a cold, so I'm gonna stand up under here. Yeah, this is Western Washington, so it may not stop raining until, you know, August. <laughs> so let me show you what I got on the inside. I got a uh, quick coat of that, uh, Whatever that color is. It looks like gray. It looks like blue. I'm not sure what it is. In the can, it looks like it's purple. <laughs> and some of the slats. But let me go up front so you can actually see that. Yeah. All right. Door's creaking. That's always nice. Make you guys dizzy here. There we go. Yeah, like I uh, mentioned in another video, we're not going to finish the interior here. Just in case we don't like it. It's just something else you can't recoup your money from. So, uh... I know, it's just one coat, so you can still kind of see through this. Maybe you can't tell here on camera, but you can. It's super thin. Same with this. This is some leftover stuff from the Vardo, and this is the color she picked. Like I said, I'm not sure what color that is. And speaking of color, while I'm standing here, whoop, I got my finger right in the way. Yeah, it's kind of cold, so it's hard to hang on to anything. But I'll pop a picture up here of what we we're going to do is the yellow and orange. That's where the whole yellow submarine thing came from. But we decided to go with some kind of an aqua or blue like this. So, yeah, we'll see how that goes. And what we did, let me uh, try to pick this up. Anyway, it's dark in here. If there was more light, it'd be easier to see. But we're going to go with uh, this, which, uh, yeah, <laughs> I can't see what I'm doing, but... Yeah, Key Largo. So, yeah, this in white. We'll see how that goes. So, what else am I doing? Uh, and I got a, I got a charge control, I guess, I can stick on there. I'm going to have to order a bunch more electrical stuff. I was going to take some stuff out of the Vardo before we sold it, but that just means we're going to be without lights in there. So, just have to get all new stuff for this thing. But yeah. Oh, here's something else. On this door, you might see this weird thing going on here now. That's actually a backing for the metal, but I believe I have a picture of that. Not complete, but just some of the parts, which I'll pop up here. And the problem with that is I post this thing on a couple of Facebook groups, and there's been a couple of times somebody said, well, your door looks too much like a swastika. So that had just been changed to... What it's going to be now. I've got a few of those parts that make it nice and dizzy. Painted and just kind of hanging here in the corner. Still got more stuff to do on that, but I'll get it eventually. Yeah, not much else to show on here other than stuff you can't see, like all the little divots that are still in this thing, which I think is just going to stay. And I'm tired of filling in holes. Yeah, you really can't tell, even on the primer. Yeah. <clears throat> Yeah, it's cold as miserable. But that's it so far. Nothing too new. So, uh, be a little bit longer before the next video is up. I'll probably do one when I get this marked out and get the white on here, or the, maybe both of the colors or something. If I can get it outside to get a better picture of it, because in here it's pretty tight. Anyway, that's uh, all I'm up to. Either waiting for this zombie virus to go away or waiting for the weather to clear up. Whichever comes first. Alright, later guys.